Hi friends, welcome to my channel Civil 3D Pro Designer. We have exercise number 4 for chapter number 14 that how to edit a pipe network using grips. Before starting you must need to know some terms related to grips. Uh, that grips are a great tool for making quick and simple graphical edits. Civil 3D provides uh, the, the some specialized grips for pipes and structures. For a structure, uh, we have square grip uh, on plan view. It will change the location of the structure without changing its rotation. As a structure is moved, the ends of any pipe that connect to it move with it. We will also practice that and we have structure circular grip uh, which will show on plan view. This grip changes the rotation of the structure without changing its location and structure have top triangular grip in profile view when we will select any structure in profile view. It will change the elevation of the top of the uh, structure and use caution when editing the top of a structure because depending on its properties the software may automatically reset it, re it to match a surface so you must need to make uh, precautions uh, and then we have structure bottom triangular grip uh, in profile view it will change the elevation of uh, sump inside the floor of structure. Another grip is uh, for the pipe midpoint triangle grip in profile view actually when you will select any pipe. Uh, this grip is used to change the diameter of a pipe dragging it away from the pipe increases the diameter and dragging it toward the pipe decrease the diameter. Then we have pipe midpoint uh, square grip on plan view. This grip moves the pipe to a new location without changing its angle or its slope which we will practice in this exercise. Another grip pipe end point with square grip on a plan view. It will move the location of one end of the pipe while keeping the other end fixed. In profile view, it maintains the current elevation of that end of the pipe. <coughs> then we have pipe end point ring triangular grip on plan view and pipe end grips profile view pipe midpoint square grip profile view. This grip change the elevation of the pipe without changing its slope. So these all grips work uh, smoothly with their respective purposes. So before starting if you are new on my youtube channel civil 3d pro designer you can start complete civil 3d advanced course on my youtube channel from chapter number one in playlist let's start our exercise you must need to download x practice drawing editing pipe networks using grips when you will open this drawing it will give you three viewports you can look at here <coughs> In plan view on the left, zoom into the inlet located at uh, station 0 plus 160 or you can see 170 we have here. Click both inlets to select them. Here we have one inlet and another inlet. When you will select them, they will show their grips. Now click the circular grip on the inlet to the east. Here we have east inlet and we need to click on this uh, <coughs> circular grip and then rotate and select this square
secure grip when you will click on secure grip your inlet will rotate this rotate the east inlet to align it with the west inlet which also aligns the east inlet with the curb also you can see now zoom into the pipe at uh, station uh, same station press escape to clear the selection first and then click on this pipe if it show you this message just click on pipe and then uh, for triangular grip just click on triangular grip and it can be moved like this so you can put something in uh, like uh, i can put 4.5 meter and press enter so it will change and by a dime inlet will be also go through with this dimensions now in the bottom right viewport viewport which we have uh, 3d view of our pipe network click the manhole uh, near the common area this one for example i want to move this circle here and just uh, click the center of uh, first click on this square grip of this main hole and then click the center of the red circle west of the main hole where you can see here okay you can see we can change our pipe network in 3d model also now we will practice in profile view click in the top right viewport and then click the pipe in the jordan code profile view that is farthest to the left uh, this pipe when you select this pipe it will show the grips according to profile view now click the bottom diamond shape grip on the left end of the pipe this and then zoom out until you can see the dynamic input dimensions text box in the text box we can also put some values like uh, 54.864 and then you will see it will go down so you can move your pipes up and down with these grips now press escape click the dynamic input icon to turn off the feature and then click the structure farthest to the left in the jordan court profile view this one now click the triangular grip at the bottom of the structure and drag it we can pick and then we can drag it something anywhere you can put something like this according to your design criteria if you will you can move your pipe something like this and you can use any grip So you can see how can we use these grips in profile view to change the location and rotations of pipes and the structures and how can we uh, use these grips in 
profile view to maintain the elevations and slope hope you like this video if you are new please subscribe civil 3d pro designer to start complete